Here in the Dragon's Den, cash-hungry entrepreneurs are about to arrive with business ideas they think could make millions. They'll pitch their ideas to five investors who could give them the money to get their businesses going. So who are our five investors? The Dragon's in the Den. Our first dragon is Doug Richard, a Californian entrepreneur who made millions buying and selling software companies. He now runs Library House, a high-tech investment company in Cambridge. Duncan Bannatyne is worth more than 130 million pounds. This Glaswegian entrepreneur has set up and sold several businesses and currently owns Bannatyne's health clubs, casinos and bars. Our new dragon is Theopaphetis. He made his 150 million pound fortune by buying failing companies and transforming them into multi-million pound businesses. He currently owns the La Senza and Contessa lingerie chains and partners and Ryman's the High Street Stationers. Rachel Elnor built Red Letter Days, a pioneering £20 million business selling gift experiences. But she hit the headlines when the company collapsed, only for the brand to be bought out by two fellow dragons. She's now using her personal wealth to invest in new businesses. Peter Jones' extraordinary business fortune began at just 16 when he started his own tennis academy. Since then he's built a £250 million empire with interests ranging from telecoms to publishing and leisure. I don't see any opportunity here whatsoever. You've come across as incredibly hard work. You are not going to succeed, I suspect. You get one chance and one chance only, and you blew it. It's probably the worst investment opportunity I have had for years and years and years. <laughs>